Hey guys, so right now I'm making poor man's liquid nitrogen. In the container that you see here, I have placed chunks of dry ice. I'm about to pour in 91% uh, isopropyl alcohol. And what it's going to do is uh, begin to melt the dry ice and kind of have an endothermic reaction. So dry ice by itself is a, poor, is a really poor thermal conductor. Like it's not cooling down this metal container at all. So um, isopropyl alcohol, on the other hand, um, it is a good thermal conductor. So it's going to really cool down this canister. And I'm going to place my sample on top of it to cool it down. So hold on a second. Right. This is the isopropyl alcohol that I am about to pour in my canister here. This stuff is like <laughs> cryogenic napalm, so you don't want to touch it. it. Like sticks to your skin like glue and freezes you. So it's going to boil for a little bit and eventually reach a kind of stable thermal equilibrium here. sure where the top is. Alright. So I'm just going to let that boil. And that, guys, is how you make poor man's liquid nitrogen.